Well, a swing set standoff as seen on TV, but this was no insurance commercial and it definitely wasn't something to laugh about. A moose near Deer Park tangled itself in swing set chains. It's fight to get free, only making things worse. Good evening. Thanks for watching KXY. This is Nightside. I'm Aaron Luna. The homeowners called for help when they found the moose. One of the responding wildlife officials recorded the tense tangle. Our Nightside reporter Kyle Simchuk spoke to that officer earlier today. Kyle, this type of situation is dangerous for several reasons. Well, yeah, Aaron, obviously moose are very big, very powerful animals. It's always a good idea to stay out of their way, especially when they feel threatened. Now, in this case, we're happy to report that moose is doing just fine, but the swing set he encountered, not so much. We had bolt cutters ready. It's a call for help Kyle Westerman won't soon forget. We kind of gassed around 900 pounds, so they, they, get, they can get pretty big. A wildlife conflict specialist, Westerman thought he'd seen it all. I had the, the whole swing set wrapped around, like the, the chain from the swing set wrapped around its antlers. This curious moose found himself in a life-threatening struggle. It was certainly tied up so bad it was it was going to severely injure itself, maybe break its skull, trying to get, get loose. Wildlife there. officials had only one option. To try to aim for the, the rump. Tranquilize the wild animal. We had to wait for the perfect shot because you want to make sure that the, the dart uh, goes into a big muscle mass. There you go. Once the drugs kicked in, fish and wildlife officers armed with bolt cutters got to work. And they lopped the, the chain off. I think they only had to cut one link and then just unwrapping. Within a matter of seconds, the moose was free and after a brief nap, ran off with only a scratch. It did have a little mark by its eye, um, but it didn't puncture the eye or anything like that. For Westerman, it's just another day at the office. But for the moose, a hard lesson that swing sets can be a pain in the butt. Now, Westerman tells me that same moose has been spotted in the same neighborhood several times after that incident, but he is keeping his distance from the playground. Wildlife officials say that the homeowners did exactly the right thing by uh, reporting the incident and also keeping their distance. Reporting live on the Skydeck, Kyle Simchuk, KXLY, 4 Nightside.